Hi, I'm Stuart Albertson of Albertson & Davidson. I want to talk to you briefly about how long a trust or a will contest lasts. Uh, we get clients asking us all the time, how long is this going to take to resolve the matter? I was taken out of a will or trust and I want to make sure I'm put back in. How long does that take? And I tell them, generally speaking, it can take anywhere from a year to two years. And that sounds like a long time, and it is, but it's a very busy filled one to two years. Some cases settle sooner, and so they won't last that long, and other cases go all the way to trial, and so they will last that long. What can you expect to happen during this one to two year process of bringing a will or trust contest? Just basically, uh, after the lawsuit is filed, you can expect uh, a period of what we call written discovery to take place. And this is just questions that are written down by lawyers on a paper that are sent to the other side and asking, please give us information, ID things, admit certain things, give us documents that we can review. And this goes back and forth for several months. After that, generally, depositions are taken of all the parties and any third party witnesses that uh, have knowledge about uh, the trust or the will contest and what happened there. That can take an, an additional three, four, five months to get along. Meanwhile, you've had several court hearings just to update the court about what's going on. And ultimately, when you complete the written discovery and the deposition process and any motions that are coming out of that, out of the discovery process, then the court is willing to set a trial date. Now, court calendars in California are quite full. And so if you go in today, for instance, and ask for a trial date, chances are it's going to be six months to a year out to get that trial date. Once the trial date is set, there are certain procedural timelines that are automatically put in place. Discovery can still continue from a written standpoint. Depositions can still be taken. Perhaps a motion for summary judgment is brought. But at the end of all of that, 30 days before trial, all discovery ends, all motion practice ends for the most part, expert depositions have been taken, and now everyone is looking at trial, getting ready for trial, getting their uh, joint witness list put together, the trial briefs put together, uh, any exhibit list for trial, all of that going forward. And generally, when you're there, you're between one to two years out from the time that you filed the trust or the will contest. Some clients think that this stuff can be resolved within a very short period of time in the court system. It can't, as, as I've just described. There is a process that must take place unless the parties decide on their own outside of the court system to settle the trust or the will contest.